everyone so new video today this is the haul video to go with my birthday meet slash week um it has been a crazy crazy week um celebrating my birthday we had a lot of wedding stuff to do this week and the kind of ultimate end was my planner meet yesterday which was crazy it was so much fun um there were a few hiccups i think that comes in par with anything that you kind of arrange um with a big group of people but yeah we had fun and um some amazing ladies come and um there was a few little little mistakes um my i first i met up with um, a lady called bonnie and alice um and we got to King's Cross and we were in the wrong part of King's Cross because unknown to me there were actually two paper chases in King's Cross. Um, so we actually ended up finding the right one and then meeting everyone. And then there were two Pizza Expresses and I ended up going to the wrong one. So sorry ladies if any of you girls are watching about that. Um, yeah, so I have a haul here for you. Um, I'm not doing this video to brag or anything I just kind of wanted to appreciate my gratitude for the amazing presents that I have received over this week and yesterday um yesterday when I was opening the presents and stuff I got really overwhelmed really fast which is not the ladies fault whatsoever it's just I don't know how to express how much I appreciate something so I just kind of talk gibberish and um stuff like that if you want to see me opening the presents when i first see them um i think grace from um miss miss paper lover she was gracious paper planner she's just switched her name um to miss paper lover yeah i'm having to look down to double check that i get it right um yeah she got a couple of my reactions when i was opening a few presents so if you want to see that i will link her channel below i don't know when her video is going to be up if her video is up when i upload this um i will link the video below but if not i will link her channel and it will be up soon so go check her out um because she got some footage of the my birthday as well um and i think she's doing a haul as well so um definitely go check her out but yeah this is a very big haul i'm gonna stop gibbering so that i can get through it all and finally put it all away so leading up to my birthday last week um well my birthday was this week but last week um i got a couple of really lovely packages in the post i got some beautiful cards which i don't actually have on me they're downstairs um ready to go into a smash book um but i also got a few little extra presents from um some of my pen pals i have so many pen pal letters to write back to so if you're waiting for me to write back to you then um that will be happening this week so just give me a chance um and i will write back to you this week at some point but yeah so the first thing that was in one of my um flipbook kind of things was this it's just this gorgeous pen in like a pink box and then it's one of those glittery ones. Can you see? Yeah, so this, I can't remember who this came from. I can't remember. So if you got me this in my one of my a pen pal letters to me, thank you so much. I love it. It has been out of my box and does actually live in my wedding planner, but I got it out and put it back in the box to show you. But yeah, thank you for this. I absolutely love it. So I got that. Then from the beautiful AJ6 Design Girls, they had literally just sent me a massive package of stickers and an extra, the extra weight loss planner, which I still haven't started yet, um, as part of the design team because I am part of AJ6 Design. <laughs> I am a part of AJ6 Design's design team. I'm still tired from yesterday. And um, as a little extra package, which I didn't know was coming, they sent me some extra stickers. So there was a lovely note, which again I've left downstairs. Um, but this is their Above the Clouds kit. 
and I think you can probably guess why they sent that to me so yeah there's a little freebie and there's some if you want to see this kit more in detail then I will link AJ6 designs below because I this haul is going to be so long but here's the main sheets some gorgeous gorgeous stickers so thank you so much to Denise and Amanda for those I'm just trying to get it to focus there you go so yeah so thank you Denise and Amanda for those I was not expecting those so yeah so that's those uh, then I had my birthday party for kind of my personal, well not even personal, but friends and family that see me every day. So my family and people I work with and that kind of stuff. So um, mostly I got vouchers. So um, a couple of my friends got me some vouchers for Hobbycraft. They know me too well. And... Um, one, another one of my friends got me some chocolates and some money to put towards London and stuff so yeah but one of my bridesmaids Claire who is a beaut bought me this this is the follow up to you before me me before you me before you I always get the one way around um, so I read the first one and sobbed um, I absolutely cried my eyes out to that and I've seen the film so this is the follow-up book to that film and book so um, I can't wait to get started on this um, I've not had chance this week to start it because I've just been so busy so definitely going to be starting this one so I got that thank you Claire uh, then on to my actual birthday so I People were asking me, like family and stuff, were asking what to get me for my birthday, and I, all I said was money for London. Um, that's all I really wanted, to be honest. Uh, so yeah, so the first person obviously is Stephen and the children. Um, Stephen gave me some money um, to put away for London, which is really lovely of him, but he also got me a little extra. Um, obviously, this came in the box, but um, I've taken it out. But it is this. A tiny little this is a pop figurine so these are the pop figurine figures it's a little Harley Quinn and she has her little tattoo there a little outfit and if anyone follows me on Instagram or Facebook or anywhere um, you will know that I actually dressed up as Harley Quinn for my birthday party which was superhero themed and uh, I can now say I have seen the film um, Suicide Squad and um, I rewatched it last night, literally as soon as I got in from London and stuff, so I was half asleep, but oh, I love her. So yeah, she sits proudly on my shelf. We have quite a few of these now, me and Stephen. Um, we're starting to kind of, these are what are the go-to that we buy each other now, but yeah, so I got that. Um, then my brother also bought me, uh, gave me some money towards London and stuff. Um, my mum, uh, or my mum and dad, actually got this, which is one of my things. It's a proper keyring, but I don't know how well that's going to show up. Oh, goodness. Don't know if you're going to be able to see that, but it's a really beautiful kind of love heart, kind of heavy keyring. Um that i love and they also got me this shirt if you have seen the vlog from my birthday meet up the blouse the, sh the white shirt i was wearing was actually a birthday present from my parents and well oh and a nail kit because i want to start doing my nails and stuff which i've forgotten to bring up i'm so sorry um but yeah so that's downstairs as well but that's what i got for my family then on to the mothership <laughs> my birthday meet now i invited quite a few ladies and i could not believe how many turned up i was so excited and happy that so many ladies turned up i love every single one of them um i know there was a few ladies that really wanted to come and couldn't 
Um, I know that Anna from um, Anna, Mrs. Brimbles, we you really wanted to come if you're watching, <laughs> but you're unwell, so I hope you're feeling better soon, darling. I know that Zoe wanted to come as well, um, and she couldn't quite make it as well. There's a few other ladies that couldn't make it, um, but yes, there will be another planner, probably another London planner meet up at some point in the new year. Um, but yeah, thank you. I mean, the, the ladies that come, oh, it was such an amazing day. And you spoiled me rotten. There was no need to bring, like, I wasn't expecting anything um, at all. And the fact that I was just inundated with presents. So thank you so much, ladies. And obviously I bought a bit as well. So I have them all in bags still and I haven't really got them in any sort of an order so I'm literally just going to start pulling stuff out and let you know who it was from but yeah so the first thing I have came obviously a lot more beautifully wrapped than this but it's in kind of like tissue paper that has letters on and stuff so there you go sorry this camera's really new and I'm still trying to get it to focus quicker um but yeah so this is from a lovely lady called Kate and a lovely lady called Suzanne or Sue and we and uh, they completely surprised me sorry um with this so it is a Windsor and Newton um watercolor art set so obviously I'm trying not to all the colors are in there. There you go. There you go. So all the colours are in there. And then the brush, which is in this top bit, you kind of untake it and then get a little brush as well. So um, they see on the, I think it was the Miss Brimble's page, I posted it on that I was looking at getting into watercolour and stuff like that, um, especially in my Smashbook and stuff. So, yeah, um, I'm so pleased with that. I can't wait to start painting. So they got me that. Thank you, ladies. Um, I then just have a pile. I got a beautiful card from... Uh, Chelsea, who's one of the girls that came yesterday, which is this gorgeous kind of pink metallic one. A lot of the ladies went towards the pink. They know me too well. So, um, a beautiful card. And inside, there was a gift card for Hobbycraft. Obviously, I have spent it, so it's not in there. But thank you, darling. I did, didn't have to do that. So, I will show you what I bought out of that in a sec. But, yeah, so that was from Chelsea. I also got a beautiful card from Emily who um, came, she was only there for this while, she came just to like the um, Kiki K and the Peace Express part. We were sitting in Peace Express for a good two and a half, three hours just chatting. Um, so I think she kind of ran out of time. But thank you for that darling. Again, that's just a beautiful birthday card and we'll go into my smash book. <laughs> um, I then got a beautiful card from Holly who is that's her real name <laughs> on facebook she's jack i can't say it all day yesterday i was trying to say it and grace was laughing at me because i could not say it jacqueline 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 i don't know she's jacqueline sparrow on facebook but her real name is holly and um she said bought me a beautiful card so thank you for that darling uh, I also got a card from jo um, Josanna and her husband who came for the meet as well. And this card is just gorgeous. It's like, um, oh, beautiful. Again, pink. They know me too well. So thank you for that. I then got a kind of wedge of stuff from a lovely lady called Debbie, um, who was insane. But so in this kind of package of stuff the first two things that were in there was some sticker sheets these are fairy deer wall stickers so they will most probably go around my desk or around me as bed depending on if she sees them or not so there's just some gorgeous stickers there so there was those there was then a stamp set by candy craft asylum 
which are all kind of yeah they're just they're kind of generic but sorry if there's glare there's those as well there was then some kind of craft paper which is kind of like gold metallic on but in different colors so like blues and greens and peaches and pinks and yellows and whites so this, that is going to come in handy for smash booking um there was then one of these little daily my schedule pads which i've been using like crazy this is one of those they would send these um, notebooks, they, they would say tiger, so I'm guessing they're from tiger. But like little kind of craft notebooks, I'll get them out for you. So they're just kind of craft on the front and then plain in the middle. I was thinking of actually sending these off for travelling notebooks. So once I get a spare five minutes this week, I will probably start those off. So there's those. This is all still from Debbie. Um, at these magnetic bookmarks there as well and then there was a beautiful card that looks handmade it's all kind of like 3d and stuff so yeah, i can't wait to put that in my smash book so there was that also um in this little wedge of stuff was some enamel dots these were from the july brimbles box i believe um Debbie knows me too well and I loved these and using them dots not heartbroken when they they run out but no pack of those. Uh there's then these stickers as well from Beautiful Planning. Um they were again in a Brimbles box. I think Debbie wasn't too sure on them, so um there's those as well. And then the main thing was this, which is I believe I can't remember. And this, which will hold my travelling notebooks in. Um, it's gorgeous, this beautiful pink colour with the flowers on. Obviously with the little um, hoop on and then the elastic. And then inside is a insert which has really cool kind of grid in. There you go. So yeah, thank you Debbie for all that. That's absolutely beautiful of you. So, oh dear, trying to get comfortable. Um, so that was everything from Debbie. I'm sorry if I'm mixing up a few things. Um, ladies that came to the um, thing yesterday, I'm trying to make sure I remember who gave me what, but I, I, I might have mixed up a few bits. But yeah, anyway. So then the lovely Bonnie from Pink Bonbons, or just Bonnie, um, who owns the Etsy store of Pink Bonbons, shall I say, um bought me some stickers from her shop oh my goodness i have been checking these out on her shop for months or weeks or however long she's had them on there um at least the last couple of weeks and i fell in love with them but i've just not had the spare funds to buy them and she's so there's this sheet which has all the kind of icons on like washing up and that kind of stuff and then there's this one which has all the weekend banners and stuff. I'm sorry if I'm going through these quick but there's a lot here to show and this video is long enough as it is. And there's this one with the little elves. Very cute. And then this one. More Christmassy stuff. And then this one. All the four boxes. And then there's this one which is her mermaid set. Gorgeous mermaid. It's all those. And four boxes. And then these ones that just say pink bonbons. It says planner meetup, planner nerds, planner girl. What are the designs on there? So there's those. Thank you, Bonnie, for those. I love those. Then Jasmine. <laughs> lovely, lovely Jasmine. She um, kind of sent me a birthday card in the week that arrived last week um hinting she put in like a insert for a planner um saying this is a hint to your birthday present and i'll give you your birthday present on the meet and i was really confused and i was like why i don't I should have realized really um and i think 
I think Grace has got from um I think Grace has got some footage of me opening this. Um, so I will link her again, I will link her below if you want to check that out. But yeah, I opened this from Jasmine and was completely lost for words. I had no idea what to say. And I think actually in the clip that Grace has got, I'm just sitting there going, because uh, 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 I just no, no, no words. But she, you probably actually see it as well, thinking about it in um the vlog from the day but i was in shock this is a miss brimble's design or miss brimble's um planner and oh my god it is gorgeous i was when these went on sale i could, I didn't have the money available to get my hands on one and I was so disappointed that I couldn't get one and then um, so I was kind of like waiting to see if they came back in stock and stuff but oh my god it is so gorgeous it's this beautiful kind of turquoise colour with the clouds on there's so many unboxings for this on YouTube and stuff and even inside she's put in inserts for the rest of the year she's put in this gorgeous pen that's blue and it's got sp like rainbow sparkles through it on this side there's a little card which i believe is from um little rainbow moon because i recognize the artwork which says bloom where you were planted there's two of these clips which i believe are from the lollipop box which i needed more of anyway because they're all in my wedding planner the ones i got some washi strips sheets here and then these stickers which are going to come in so handy for bits of stationery and they say film upload and edit so i can start planning my youtube videos a lot more so she's actually like decked it out with stuff as well and oh my goodness it is so gorgeous i cannot wait to get this started so thank you Jasmine for this so 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 much I absolutely love it so there's that as well <laughs> then Grace <laughs> you absolute darling she as soon as she pretty much as soon as she seen me handed me this bag of goodness and I waited until we were sitting down eating pizza or whatever we were eating um, to sit down and go through it all. And I could not believe how much was in this. It is unreal. So, Grace, you little star. Thank you. I love absolutely everything in here. So, I'm just going to start putting stuff out. So, the first thing that was in here was this. This is a die cut toppers from the Centauro range. Some of them have, like, fallen out. Like, they've um like it's like down there it's like they've like come out but they, they are all still in there but yeah um i absolutely love this range and the die cuts from it i'm sparingly using the last few ones i've got so i'm really excited to see those so there's some of those in there also in here is some washi tape yeah but it's like super skinny washi tape i don't actually have a lot of skinny washi tape to be fair getting comfortable <laughs> so there's those as well um there's also a beautiful tag on it which says my name i'm gonna be doing like five smashbook pages on this i think um then there's what else is in here there's also a card which again has a beautiful little envelope that says my name again with a hot air balloon because she knows me also a little pink skull <laughs> it's just down to the last details she knows me too well so uh, there was this uh, card in there um there was also oh my god this this is a peter pauper press journal and i don't know how well the camera is going to pick this up it is a notebook and it has this gorgeous floor on there's some tiny bits of foil on there i don't know if that's picking up but um there's that and then there's this really cool 
gorgeous green elastic on so you open it up and it's pink inside so that was another winner and then the pages are kind of like an off yellow um lined and oh my god i literally spent a good five minutes looking at this it is gorgeous so I absolutely love it, Grace. Thank you. So there's, there was that. The next things are some stickers. Um, the lovely Grace went to the UK Planner Meet last week and she had a huge goodie bag of stuff, um, which I was very jealous of. And she um, said that she was looking through it and found a few bits that she wasn't quite sure were her style. Uh, but she knows I love pink and I love cake. And um, yeah, so she's um, put a few bits in from the goodie bag that she feels were more my style, which is lovely of her. So the first things that are here are some stickers and they are cakes. Gorgeous, so there's those in there. There's also these stickers which are, they say, never stop, you got this, like a boss, make it happen, stay focused. Just little kind of inspirational quote stickers on there. Don't know if they're going to focus, but there's those. There's then a paper pad in here, which is called Icing on the Cake. It's like she's it, so she just she just knows me. And there are some gorgeous gorgeous papers in here they smell like proper scrapbook paper as well stripey one that's too much design floor one oh three rich design blue one spotty one are they repeating oh no Green spotty one, green floral one, <laughs> blue floral one, pink cakes, and more of those gorgeous flowers, and blue spotty as well. So they are gorgeous, can't wait to start using those. The next thing is another paper pad, and it is all pink. So she knows me too well. It is a 15 centimeter by 15 centimeter one. Okay. And they are all just some gorgeous patterns on there. So there's that as well. I'm still going. Um, there's a sticker set here by Half of Everything, which is like a galaxy set, which is one I've actually had my eye on. I don't know whether Grace, if I said to Grace that I was looking at it, I think ages and ages and ages ago we may have been having a conversation about these sticker sets and I mentioned I really 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 like these ones so there's those as well there's then these um she did a, when she did her haul video last week for the planner meet she mentioned she'd bought these for my birthday and they do actually look like me which is kind of scary <laughs> But they're just these stickers of these little girl doing some kind of Christmassy things. So those. I'm really sorry if they're not. It's not focusing, but I have to kind of whiz through these. There's also this beautiful bookmark in there, which has this blue tassel on, which will be good when I start my new book. So this is gorgeous bookmark. There's it then some of these kind of crafty flowers on wire as well which are pink beautiful um there's also a sticker sheet here from the planners coffee house which is just kind of like a full sticker sheet just gorgeous as well so there's that one in there there's also <laughs> when um grace did her um unboxing for the haul that she did i see this and literally fell in love and i didn't say anything but i think she's kind of figured out that i'd love it it's the fluffy charm uk from the big me obviously from the big meat thing but look at that it's like a pink pom-pom and it has like an almost rose rose gold kind of 
um, crown on it with a little purple heart. And also it's got a really long kind of charm. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. So, so beautiful. I love it. Thank you so much for that. I love that. There's then some paper clips which have the numbers 1 to 9 on, or 0 to 9 on, which are really cool. Rainbowed as well. Pink tissue paper. <laughs> There's then this as well from her goodie bag. It's called They're from Love by Penny, but I don't know, actually know what it is. I know it's a bow. I don't know. Can't get in it. Oh, it's a pin. It's like a badge. A little bow. Um, then there's some um, little mini nail files that have owls on as well. And some blue washi tape that has some spots on and stuff. So, Grace, thank you so much for all of that. I Seriously, darling, I love it. And the cheeky little madam decided to fill the bag with sequins. Oh, there's quite a few in there. Which one exploded over me when I was over in all in Pizza Hut or Pizza Express, wherever we went, I can't remember. And two, when I got home, um, I put all my stuff in like a pile and then went to bed. And when I came downstairs with the children this morning, Mia was throwing the, the uh, sequins from this bag all over my front room. So now I have to hoover those up. So thank you for that, darling. <laughs> I'm not ungrateful, I promise, but yeah, thank you for that. Uh, then on to, I believe, what I bought. <laughs> so the first shop we actually went into was Kiki K, which, you know, is always gonna be dangerous. Last time I went on a plan of me um, to London, I didn't actually buy anything in Kiki K, which was kind of surprising. But this time I was determined to buy something and I was looking at their wedding planners, but I've already got one and I didn't really need another one. So um, from Kiki K, I found this. It is called a anniversary journal. I'm not going to be able to get into it. It's in this really kind of sweet box. And then you've got to try and take it out of the box, which won't happen. There you go. So on the front, on the front it says the best is yet to come. And in this journal, every year on your anniversary, you kind of reflect for the year. There you go. Focus. So you have first anniversary, reflection, and you have kind of all different options and spaces to fill it out, and then you take a picture. So on the left here it says year, so you say what year it'll be in. So we're getting married next year in 2017. So our first year anniversary will be 2018. So we'll put 2018, you put how the year went, so you tick which one. Um, this year's best moments, this year's challenges, how we celebrated our anniversary, three things that we would love to do in the next 12 months, and then you put a little picture of yourself in the bottom there. And it literally goes up. Obviously the edges are gold, which is beautiful as well. And then it goes all the way up to 60, 60th anniversary, which is, is fun. So that's what I got from Kiki K. The next place we went to is Paper Chase. <laughs> I went a little bit crazy in there. I think as well, I've been influenced by people like Grace and Alice. If you watch Grace's um, haul video from Saturday, you will see that I maybe may have influenced one of her purchases from Kiki K. So when we got to um, Paper Chase, then I think she kind of got her own back on me a little bit. Um, but yeah, so I bought a little bit, a little bit. I also bought something for a future giveaway as well, but yeah, anyway. So, oh, first of all, <laughs> I went into the paper chase where we were actually meeting everyone. Um, we got a little bit 
distracted by pretties in the tiny little paper chase that's actually in um, King's Cross Station. So the first thing I bought out of there was these paper clips. They're like a rose gold one and they come in all different shapes as well. I send these with everything. Happy Mail, in my planner, smash the pages I use them in. I run out of these like they're going out of fashion. So these are really beautiful. I love the rose gold. So these were £2.50, so I got those. And the other thing I got in there were just these Peter Rabbit stickers. Which are kind of like thick and stuff. These are £1.50. But they're just so beautiful. So yeah, I got those as well. And the bigger paper chase, the one in Tottenham Court Road. Uh, what's in here? Envelopes. <laughs> um, I can't remember who found these. I think it was Jasmine who found these. Um, they are the Dovecraft Paper Mania Wedding Ever After stickers. So they are the stickers, you're supposed to put them on wedding invites, but the front of my wedding invites already decided. So I'm gonna stick these on the envelopes. So, um, to seal the envelope completely. So there are a hundred, uh, uh, 204 pieces in here. If I can get them out so there's no glare. They were two pounds, but they were on, they were reduced down to a pound, which I thought was amazing. So apparently you get 204 in here, but they're like die cuts. Are they stickers or die cuts? Oh, they're die cuts. So I can easily just stick them on the envelope anyway, but they just say, they just say, where's an invitation to our special day? So yeah, I hope you can see that. Um, there are some like little corner bits and stuff, which I may actually use on the actual invites, but yeah, for a pound, I couldn't really say no to those. So thank you, Jasmine, for finding those. I then bought a selection of postcards. Some of them were on sale, some of them weren't. Um, so this one was not on sale. I think it was like 35, like a pound or 75p or something less than a pound. Um, it's just this one that says, wish you were here. It's all gonna be traveling postcards eventually. This one, <laughs> everyone had been joking. I love only love pink and cake. Um, and when we went into Paper Chase, I see this and could not get, could not get it basically a postcard about me um so yeah i got that as well i then found some postcards that were on sale so this one was down to 15p and it just has some palm trees on and it says wildlife on there and there's this one that says rules were made to be broken and again it says 15 pence it's one that's kind of craft card so there's that one and this one that says up, up and away with a little lion in that says rah. <laughs> and um, obviously hot air balloons and it was 35 pence on sale. So I got those. I then found these. Uh, there was like a huge table of sale stuff right at the front of Paper Chase. And me and, well, all the girls found it. Pretty much cleared them out. <laughs> But in a little basket, me and Grace found some paper clips. So we found these ones, which are by details, I think. But they were four pound reduced down to two pounds. And they're bow ones. I think I've only ever owned once, one or two of these. Um, yeah, so I got those because they were cute. So those. Then I, oh. Then I found the mini ones. To match those again these were three pound down to one pound fifty so they're tiny little mini bowls so i thought they were really cute so i got those as well i then got these these are the um dragonfly paper clips i think quite a few people have been getting these from paper chase um i completely missed this section it's only when we sat down halfway through paper chase um in the cafe upstairs and had something to eat that i see jasmine had these in her basket and i had to tell her to come and t tell her to tell me where they were because I needed them I don't know how or if I'm going to use them but they're just so gorgeous so these were three pounds I just I love those so I got those I'm trying to leave the big things to the end I then got some scrapbook paper unfortunately it's been a little bit crumpled in the on the journey home but um I will still use it. So the first thing I got was this. It's kind of like an acetate sheet that has these kind of glittery 
pink love hearts on. This is from American Crafts. Um, this was two pounds. I thought this would be a really cool background for the Smashbook page. For this meetup, I just think it's kind of a subtle background that does, does still cover the Smashbook page, but doesn't cover it completely. Um, so that. I then got some scrapbook card. I'm really annoyed that it got crumpled on the way, but this is by Dear Lizzie, Find and Dandy range. It's called Love Fest, and it has little love hearts on. It's been kind of crumpled at the bottom there, but there, and the reverse of that is just some pink spots, so there's that. The other one I got is this one by Seven Paper Studio Calico, called Goldie, so it just has the kind of paint spodges across it and then this one uh, the other side is just kind of like a circle pattern so i got those then the bigger things there was a big selection of planners on sale now i don't really technically need any more planners but i couldn't not get them <laughs> um, so yeah kind of got a few planners um, so the first one I got was this one. This is the butterfly one. It is a 2017, uh, 2015 planner. So it's an extremely old planner. Um, originally it was on so being sold for £16. It was down to £5.50. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous planner. Yeah, I may give this away in a... I, I will probably do a giveaway for this because... I don't need any more planners yeah so look out for that giveaway I don't know when it's gonna be it'll probably be at some point next week um I don't know but yes so I got that as well I then got this this is actually I can get this one out because I'm not gonna give this one away this is mine um, it's 18 month one between July 2015 and December 2016 so there is a few dates in well months probably at the back of this that is still usable um, but I'll get it out of here to show you I believe this is an A5 um, so yeah it's just so pretty it's just gorgeous kind of um, teal not even teal like a greeny bright blue colour it has the kind of flowers and birds on and stuff. It's so gorgeous. And then inside it has like notes and stuff for the and then like the rest of the year. And also, you have some like coloured paper at the back. That wasn't in my other one. And then a great big notepad at the back as well. So if you want to see that in kind of closer detail or more of a unboxing of that, then um comment below and I'll do a separate video for that if you want that put the glass one so yeah I got that oh. so I bought a lot of planners um yeah so the last place we went into is Tiger now I did buy two presents for my children um one was kind of like a um toy thing it was like a wooden block that had circles in and it had like little shapes that went in it and it kind of they turn, you have to put them in a certain order for them to all turn. Um, for my son and then for my daughter, I, I bought like a picture matching um, kind of one. Um, they had them this morning and they've taken them to nannies with them, so they're not actually in the house, so I couldn't show you those. But um, yeah, so I bought them a little present each. Um, I think they're around five, six pounds each, not really that expensive, but I wanted to buy them a present out of Tiger, so I got them then. Also, out of Tiger, the other bits I got, try and, uh, she tries and takes them all out at once. Okay, so the first thing I got were these washi tapes. Um, I was actually went in to look for these and walked straight past them, and then Grace um, was like, "Gem, didn't you want these?" Yeah, so um, they're just uh, different washi tapes for Halloween. So there's those. Also, they have their washi tapes too for a pound in there. So I got this one, which is kind of like a blue and green stripey one. And then this one, which kind of has different stripes on in different colours. That one. So there's those. I then got these tiny little paper clips, which are 
little triangles. I got those, they were I think a pound for those or 50p or something on those lines. Um, I got those. I then see this tray. Now you can get these in all different sizes and colours and shapes. But they kind of fit together to make that or whatever. And when I'm doing um, smash, especially smash book pages or something like that and I'm using quite a lot of die cuts and stuff. I always kind of pre-plan what ones I'm going to use so I kind of take them out of my stash and have them on my desk. Nine times out of ten, when I then start filming and I'm kind of going through and I'm like, right, I need that die cut. It has blown off the table somewhere or it's got tucked in somewhere and I can't find it and then I can't find it until after I finish filming. So I got this tray to go onto my desk um, so that I can kind of have it sitting there with all the die cuts I plan to use in or I can kind of sort through them and find them. Um, and yeah, so I bought that. That was a pound. And then bought one of these. These, on all the planner um, Facebook groups, people have been going loopy for them. Um, they're like, I think they were, it's two pounds. Yeah, it was two pound. And you not only get the actual cover, which is gorgeous anyway, and it's kind of like this black and white stripe with the yellow um, snappy elastic on it. Um, but then you get the ins, you get this, this is what I couldn't understand. The inside is like furry. Um, you then get this page here, which you can untie and have little bits in there. You then get two inserts, one of which has lined paper in, and then one has really small kind of square paper in, which I don't know if you can see. hope you can see that and then the back you have another pocket as well and it's and then the back you have a, another pocket as well so and the back you have another pocket as well so for two pounds for the cover and both books is really really amazing so I thought that'd be really good to kind of, if I'm kind of out and about and I just want to quickly journal something down or write something or do some painting or whatever, um, I have that. So, and it's kind of wiped clean as well. So I get paid on it, I can just kind of wash it off. So I got those, or that, shall I say. Um, so yeah, so on to what I bought today. This video is finally about to come to an end. I'm sorry, my phone keeps vibrating. Then onto what I bought today. I got two Hobbycraft vouchers for my birthday. One from a friend at my birthday party, which I think I mentioned, and one from um, a lovely girl at my planner meetup yesterday. And I couldn't wait any longer, and I had to go to Hobbycraft. So, um, I got some stuff. So, a lot of this stuff is kind of stuff that I've wanted for quite a while, but you always feel different when you're in there with vouchers rather than when you're in there with actual money so um because i had vouchers i kind of bought things that i've always wanted but didn't want to commit to buying with money even though i know that i'm going to use all of these but yeah so i don't know how well this is going to show up if i just show you like that there you go you can see that it's kind of this is these were on sale some um scrapbook cards this is kind of cream and it has some like cupcakes kind of embossed onto it almost which again I thought for the smash up pages for yesterday and on my birthday and stuff I'm sorry the sun is streaming in this window now um but yes that was 50 pence I also got this which is kind of a cut apart one again for more birthday stuff um keep calm party on I love that one and then on the back it's just kind of like a confetti one this is by Case Craft and it's called Pop Oh no, it's from the Pop Collection and it's called Frosting. Um, so yeah, oh that does, it looks like icing. Mm. Uh, and then the last one is just some plain craft paper. This is from Jim Holtz. Tim Holtz. This is from Tim Holtz, the uh, Distress Collection. I don't know if this actually has a name. 
but it's kind of like a distressed purple look um and i thought to kind of use to smash for any wedding stuff because this is one of our main colors for the wedding and again 50p can't go wrong okay then to the serious stuff so I got some more ribbon, which is this sort of purple thin ribbon um, for my wedding invites because I didn't have enough and I need to finish those off or have everything to start making them. You know what I mean. Uh, but yeah, so the first stickers I got were from American Crafts Thickers. These are the alphabet ones. These are black with kind of gold lines through them. You can see that. Um, so I got those ones. Also in the thickest section of Hobbycraft, we've got these. These are chipboard, chipboard ones. I can't remember what these are called though. But they are just these floral kind of ones. I'm seriously running out of alphabet stickers. Then I bought these ones. These are the Do Crafts um, Christmas ones thicker set they're not two sided they're all on there I think you can see there's two sheets on there and they're kind of white with gold stripes but I thought they weren't necessarily Christmas like completely Christmas um, so I got those I then bought this which is something I've wanted for ages particularly word stickers so there's loads of different words on there I'm not going to go through them all, but they're just like little words to kind of accent a page. So you get three pages of the white, and then three pages, three pages of the black. Um, and that was £4.50. Uh, all the thickers, sorry. These two were £4, and the Christmas one for £3. Just so you know. So I've been using a lot of these. I got a sheet of these, I think, like, well, a sheet of word stickers in a um, Studio Calico kit a couple of months back and fell in love with them and only have the odd word like and or it or is. Um, so I kind of needed some more words. Um, so I know that I'm going to use them, especially in Smashbrooking and stuff. So I have bought those. I also bought this which is a project life kit these are 180 cards i've wanted to buy some project life cards for so long and i always kind of get a load in like happy mail and stuff but then i don't want to send them on i kind of want to use them so i was running out because i was sending a load off and using a load in my smash book and stuff so i kind of wanted some they have so many different designs of, of ones as well, but these um, kind of match the next few Smashbook pages I'm going to be doing. So I thought I'd get these. Um, I will do a kind of flick through of them. I have to take them out of the box, but they've got plastic on as well. So yeah, I will do a longer flick through at the end of this video. So um, if you want to see what all of these are, wait until the end and I'll speed up a kind of flick through of them. So I got those and the last thing I went and got in Hobbycraft was this. I got a new smash book. I have needed a new one for a while now. Um, the la di -da one I've got downstairs is getting pretty thick and I've got quite a few smash book pages planned over the next few days. But I didn't. I was kind of almost too scared to do them because I didn't want to finish off the book. Now I have a new smash book. I'm going to finish off that one downstairs. So this one is by Kane Company. So it's from a different brand because I just fell in love with it. This is twelve pounds, I believe. You open it up and you have this little acetate thing, and then obviously the pages. There are a lot more pages in this because obviously it hasn't got the clip, so you can't put more paper in. But that was kind of they were kind of a help as well as a hindrance those clips because um you kind of um they clipped or unclipped for their own purposes and but yeah so these are all the pages in there so I got that as well so I, I just I can't wait to get started. 
So yeah, that was everything I got for my birthday, bought at my birthday, was gifted at my birthday, and all that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go because my battery is flashing at me. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I hope it's not been too long for you. Um, and yeah, thank you to everyone who bought me stuff for my birthday. I feel so blessed and so loved. Um, but yeah, I now have to go and tidy this mess. But thank you for watching this video, guys. And I'll speak to you in my next one. Bye.